the mango sticky rice. Jeez! The runner up next! Right. What's that? Oh man, hey, 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 laugh off. We're heading to Chiang Mai right now. We're going to go take explore this Thai food right now. We're at the damn port. Chiang Mai right now. We're about to do the damn thing. The oh, ambiance looks nice inside. They even have golden spoons. Fanciest drink. Is that for me? No, oh, I thank you. Does it have to be approval? She said we can eat the stuff. Yeah, it's edible. <laughs> yeah, you can eat it. Do it. Try it out. Like you got the time. This is so Pizza fun. pineapple trip. Dude. We, have, blah, blah. we over here eating flour. Chiang Mai. Can I get a pineapple chip? <laughs> can I get a piece of your pineapple chip? Oh, that's not bad. Chewy. It's about to go down. You see, you see what's going on. They got a flag. How come this thing in it? <laughs> now we got a rock right. It looks like a tornado. About to do the damn thing. It looks lovely right now. Leaning, leaning tower of uh, of time. It's about to be right in here, <laughs> not over there. <laughs> You keep your distance, young lady. You keep your little distance over there, young lady. Fresh eggs and a golden curry sauce. What do they call it? The koi soy? The, 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 the cow soy. You got lemongrass, fried onions, pickles, all the things. You see the golden curry sauce? It, it's a, trying to keep it all right. Like, the leaning, leaning tower of Thai right now. Let them know what we're what I'm having right now. Alright, so that one is like the yeah. and like it's like the curry sauce, like the general curry. And we add some like the bill pepper and the pickles and some cilantro. Some and tiger the, shrimp. Yeah, mm. tiger shrimp. And the best one it should be the breast beef. If you like beef. Mm. Yeah. Mm. It's it's kind of like softer. And we put on top with the egg, boy egg. Mm. And also the that one, the thing is like the uh, crispy egg noodles. I'm gonna need me another one of those pineapple chips. You know that whatever the that edible edamame was on her drink. Oh. We, we're gonna have the pineapple chips. Can, oh, you, pineapple can you bring? Oh yeah, of, you want more of that? I, I would love one of those. Your yes. eggs. Get your, eat your eggs. Get, ooh, more pineapple chips for me. Yeah. Awesome. Get your protein up. Look, look. Get your protein up. Mmm. Mmm. Pineapple chips are busting. Mmm. <laughs> Tastes different. So in the pad thai we use like the thin rice noodles and we add some tamarind sauce in it. Yeah, I mean like if the people who love tamarind sauce, they're gonna like that one. And also we add like some meat, tofu and the chai and also the beef sprouts. Let me show you a fun fact. In a few parts of the Caribbean, we use tamarind sauce on roti, palari, doubles. Oh really? I it's don't amazing. Know. Oh. They run out of tamarind sauce because of me. I'm the, I'm, I'm, I'm the dude that's always like extra oh. tamarind sauce, extra. And, they're like, no, for you, we can't. And then when I leave, I hear the other guy got the tamarind sauce. They lie. They be hiding it in the back. <laughs> they got a secret stash of tamarind sauce. Definitely worth the mess. Hello. Hello. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Okay, good. Mmm. I'm gonna savor the flavor. Flavor's my neighbor. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. Taste the difference. Taste the curry. Delicious. It's, it's, it's delectable. I'm gonna be honest, man. I'm gonna give this a solid eight. I'm gonna give the pad thai a seven. Yeah. And the curry dish was, was not so bad. Like seven, eight, yeah. Seven. The lemongrass and ginger had a little bit of an overpowering kicker. The base, the curry base, wasn't too. A lot of places you go where the curry sauce is a bit too thick or whatever, it was it was not too, too. It looks too good. Lemongrass. No, it, no, it was good, it was good, it was good. That's why I said, I'm gonna stick with the eight. Like, I'm like, you know what? I'll give it a solid. How was your drink? I give it a uh, 100 because I got tank from Bella. I got an awesome drink. I got awesome food. And plus, it looks a little fancy here. I want you guys to let me know if I should check out the Red Room next because apparently there's a lot of hype about Red Room Thai food. 
here in the GTA. I got Avery with me, gang gang. All right. You don't gotta go home and get the hell out of here. Taste the difference. This stuff's so good. I'm drinking it. Hey, 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 Tell me about this, this sauce. So that one is a coconut milk, and we add some butter flying peas to make it have a color. And that butter one is butter flying a, peas. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And the yellow one is like the mango puree. All right. Let's dive halfway through this yummy mango sticky rice, man. With the sauce, man. Oh, amazing. The coconut milk. Oh, what's going on? With? <laughs> it's exactly what we do in Thailand. I don't like the sticky ones. It's too coconut. <laughs> Where else were you here with me? You could have been at the after school program, all right? The little one. <laughs> we were like, you could have been at the detention. Can you let them know what? Let them know about the coconut cream sauce. Alright, so in here we add like the sticky rice that marinate with the butter flying pea and some coconut milk. And on the top we add like the fresh mango. Yes, and very nice. Good. So what is the butterfly pea? Yes. So for the butter flying pea, it's kind of like a flower. So normally it's supposed to be like a blue color. Yeah, it should be blue. And yeah. then like if we add some like acid, like some lime or lemon in it, it's going to change the color to purple. Ah, so it's like a yeah. dye kind of like that. Yeah. Solid tens all across the back. Winner, Genyo. Tastes different. Guys, make sure you check out my video right now of when I was at Pad Thai Cuisine in Changu, Bali. Like I said, it's home of the best of the best mango sticky rice. And I mean, what other better place to try it when you're, you're in Southeast Asia? But over here, they got imitation. I mean, they do the Lord's work over here, but that's where they got the real deal.